Sarah from Average Betty here and I'm making no cook cookies and cream ice cream. You don't need much for this super easy all natural no cook ice cream recipe. You don't even need an ice cream maker. What you do need is a little bit of patience and a whole lot of self control. Let's make no cook cookies and cream ice cream. Whenever I'm making something no cook that uses raw eggs, I use Davidson's safest choice pasteurized eggs because nothing really spoils a good batch of ice cream quite like salmonella poisoning. Here's a little bowl and here's this handy dandy little egg separator. I came in like a wrecking ball. How do you separate your eggs? The eggshell back and forth, the water bottle trick. Okay, here are the whites and the yolks. Let's whip them like crazy, shall we? It helps if your eggs are really cold. So I chill the mixing bowl and whisk attachment. The yolks, some vanilla, coarse salt, and sugar. It's a lot of sugar, but we're making ice cream, not salad. Crank this monster up, and you don't need one of these. You could do all of this with a handheld electric mixer. You're really looking for this to double in volume and get a pretty pearly sheen. No relation to Charlie. There. That looks about right. It's almost the consistency of condensed milk. And I'm gonna get this into the fridge. And onto the whites. Vanilla. Sugar. Here we go. Like a soft, fluffy pillow. Get this into the refrigerator. And if you thought I was done with the mixer, think again. Here's some heavy cream. I think heavy cream is going to be my new wrapper name. Ta-da! Again, get this into the fridge. And if all that whipping has you in a spin, it's time to whack some cream-filled chocolate cookies. You know the ones. Now let's bring it all together and make ice cream. I've got a big bowl here, and this is the egg yolk mixture. See how thick and rich that is? This is the whipped cream. Get all that goodness in there. Ever so gently fold this together. Now for the egg whites. Isn't this amazing? Just eggs, sugar, cream, vanilla, and salt. That's five ingredients for those of you keeping score at home. And this is where all natural ends. I know it's tempting to just dive into this vat of airy sweetness, but patience, my friends, and rewarded you will be. Here's a loaf pan, but any freezer safe container will do. A few more cookie pieces to let you know what you're about to scoop into. Cover the whole thing with plastic wrap and allow to chill in the freezer overnight. Patience! And when it's done, it'll look like this. Did I mention self-control? Scoop it up, bowl it up, cone it up. I don't need to tell you how to eat ice cream. Get the no cook cookies and cream ice cream recipe at safeeggs.com. So next time you want some homemade ice cream, I hope you'll give my no cook cookies and cream ice cream a try. After all, patience is a virtue and self-control, come on, you got it. Thanks for watching and subscribing. See you next time. Mmm, cookies and cream ice cream.